Just so welcome well. to like our ten. second Dude, general like meeting <laughs> of the semester. Um, as you can tell, we have to do an meeting. If you don't know what ASA is, you will find out. Um, so, just a couple announcements um, before we get started with our meeting. Okay, so I'm going to have Haley talk about uh, Dance Marathon, which is going to be a wild card Woo! point. Woo! Um, and that's going to be the weekend of the 21st. Also, we're going to do Korean barbecue that weekend on the 22nd, on Sunday the 22nd. So it's going to be a wild card point at a social on um, that weekend. So Haley's going to talk about Dance Marathon and then up, Korean barbecue is a ton of fun. So.
I'm just going to give a brief, super brief introduction about what we're doing today. So I'm sure you guys have heard me mention several times throughout the year, throughout the semester, maybe if you guys are new, that last year we won ASDA's annual pre dial competition. Okay? It was the first year. Huge win for us. Um, it's not that it, you know, kind of, you know, qualified us in any way, but it did just put a merit on our organization saying that, you know, we are DBS, we're here, and we're really good. And, you know, it kind of put us on the map as far as other pre dental organizations across the nation go. So um, it's a really good organization to be a part of. And, you know, we brought Stephanie to talk about it. She was president. Um, she was president, vice president. She was everything when she was a part of DBS. And now she's a third year at Austro. So, um, should listen to anyone, not me, and listen to Stephanie. So let's welcome, let's welcome Stephanie.
might have gotten CDA presents. And that's a basically, that's basically a coalition of dentists and dental students in California. There's ASDA, there's ADEA, which is the American Dental Education <coughs> Association, and uh, on campus we have the graduate student government. So me being me, I submitted my application, I applied, they interviewed me, and I got the ASDA position. I didn't really know what I was getting myself involved in, but I was really excited because they pay for all of my flights to you know these awesome conferences. So I got involved in ASDA as a first year dental student, went to conferences, met a lot of cool people, and I was like, I want to become a net leader on a national level. Uh, so I worked my way up. Currently, I am a contributing editor on the editorial board. Um, so it's definitely, you know, it's definitely been a really great experience. Uh, for all of you guys who are looking to get involved, there are so many ways for pre to get involved with ASDA. I bring this up not to really talk about me, but uh, kind of I wanted to say, so next year on our editorial board, we have a first year dental student um, who was selected. And the reason he was selected, he wrote for us as a pre -dent. He wrote an amazing article. Um, I think it won an award or something. And so he was selected for the editorial board as first year. So it's so wonderful that you guys are hearing about this now and getting involved. And you can really open a lot of pathways for you when you're in dental school. Uh, this is my friend Darren Liu, otherwise known as the Goofy Bowtie Guy, if you guys ever go to ASDA events. Um, he is currently our vice president uh, until February when we have annual session. But like, like the editor who got on the editorial board, he was also super involved as a pre -dent. So he went to a ASDA conference as a pre -dent way back before he started dental school. Um, he worked his way up in the ranks and look where he is now. So there's a lot of pathways for you guys to become involved. There's, I'm, I'm sure you're wondering if there's positions you can apply for as a pre -dent. So we do have a pre-dental position. We actually have six of them. Um, the pre-dental consultant is a position where you get to actually travel with us to these national conferences and meetings. And you guys advocate on behalf of pre-dental students across the world and create policy uh, across the United States and create really awesome policies to encourage other people to join. So these are just some ways that you guys as pre-dents can get involved really early. Um, like I said, ASDA is really amazing because we have all these national conferences that you guys can attend. You can network with hundreds of thousands of dental students and pre-dental students. Uh, in October, we just had our national leadership conference in Chicago from October 31st to November 2nd. We met a lot of wonderful pre-dents there. Um, next week, we're actually having our annual session in Boston. Um, and it's a really <coughs> fun-filled event, uh, week of events. And so I'm just kind of showing you guys how there are ways you guys can get involved as pre to attend these to attend these meetings, to network with dental students and other pre -dents. And these are just some of the ways to get involved. As the, basically, we, our purpose is to advance the rights of dental students. Um, so we're very heavily involved in politics. So if this is kind of your cup of tea, as is definitely for you. Uh, we have National Dental Student Lobby Day every year in the spring. I believe this year it's Basically, you get to, you're trained on how to talk to legislators. So usually every year they'll have some sort of bill. Um, my first year when I went, we were debating the Student Loan Interest Act, and we were trying to find a way to cap student loan interest rates. Um, and so I got to meet with a lot of wonderful legislators on Capitol Hill in their offices and kind of talk to them about those issues. And that's kind of one of the fortes of ASDA as an organized dentistry uh, organization. So we also have a lot of, uh, you can get involved with writing for us. So as, as a member of the editorial board, I work with a lot of pre dental students writing articles for our publications. Michael has kindly presented me some of these. So Mouth is our journal. It's a journal of the American Student Dental Association. We also have As the Need. Um, that you can write for us. We have a bunch of different ways to communicate with members. And so I wanted to, you know, if you guys are interested in getting involved, definitely reach out to me and I can guide you guys in the right direction. Um, I think this is the highlight of as a membership. For free then. Yeah, so as, as a member, if you join, you get a copy of this wonderful <coughs> book. Um, 
lot of, have you read through? Yeah, so this book, like I said last year, I called it the Bible, okay? This book is incredible because in, in your $63 for membership, this is what you're paying for right here. This is, this is it, in my opinion. The $60 gets you this book, and in the book, every single page of the book is one dental school from you know all 50 states and Dominican Republic and like Puerto Rico, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it talks about all the dental schools, but it goes into vivid detail about what each dental school requires. Their science requirements, their average GPA, what, uh, you know, how many letters of rec, who you need letters of rec for. This is all listed out for you in this book, so you don't have to waste time researching what, you, like, what each school requires. So UCLA, USC, every school requires something different. Gives it to you right there, and it's updated every year, so you'd be getting the latest version. I was just going to say, yeah, I use this book actually a lot um, to, to choose which schools that I was going to apply to. So I think, I know we were talking about a lot about like that last meeting, but just to pick which schools that like would even fit your like application. Like, it's have, it, have you taken this course? If you have it, maybe you shouldn't apply there. Yeah. Do they accept out of state? If they don't, maybe you shouldn't apply there. And not only that, it talks about tuition yeah. so and financial aid and stuff like that. So it is a very, 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 very helpful.
want to employ you guys to join as a, you know, um, to really enrich your experiences as a pre-dent and to be a part of something bigger. And I'm gonna, is the volume on? Uh, Nick. So many friends. Because sixty three dollars, think of how much money you save when you have to go for an interview and you don't have to rent a hotel room. So that sixty three dollars is worth it. But um, truly, truly, ASDA has impacted me for the better. I think as the ASDA representative of my class, I have enriched my experiences so much more than everyone else, all my peers. Um, and you guys as pre-dents. Stephanie did a really good job about talking, you know, why ADSA is good for dental students and for pre-dental students as far as the whole, you know, um, political aspects goes and, you know, how it can help advance your career and stuff like that. I think I can speak to it as a pre-dental student because I've been a part of ASDA since my sophomore year, okay? And ASDA is great, okay? It is organizational dentistry on a national level. And dental schools 
they want to see that on your application. So that's what I'm gonna be talking about, all right? You know me, I can be real with you guys and I'm gonna tell you the honest truth. Dental schools want to see that you're a part of this, okay? There's pre-dental classes in Colorado, in New York, in Florida. They're all joining ASDA because it is growing, okay? It is, it is something that, not a necessity on your application, but dental schools really love it because it is a context for them to talk to you about it. Oh, I went to this ASDA conference and you know, I, I met this congressman and we talked about politics and stuff like that. It is a great, great thing for interviews, okay? When, I, when Ryan was still here, he, uh, we had our ASDA meeting last year and he kept advocating for all of you guys, all the credence to join ASDA because it looks really good <coughs> for your application. Not only do you get the free dental Bible, right? It really helps you, saves time, but also you get invited to all these conferences. And these conferences, they're not just for dental students like Stephanie, they're for pre-dental students. I went with a bunch of current first years last year to a conference in, I think it was in Anaheim. District 11, nice. right? It was in Anaheim. So I went there and it's a very cool thing because you're with a bunch of dental students, not just from USC, UCLA, UOP. You get, you know, you get introduced to all these dental students, all their experiences, all their advice, okay? And these conferences, they're not just for dental students. They're not just like, oh yeah, let's talk about insurance. Because I mean, for me, that's really boring. I'm not just gonna sit and talk about insurance. No, they had stuff that was tailored for pre-dental students. They had certain pre-dental sections. So the workshops that we do, they put on a workshop. The interview workshop that we did, they had an interview workshop. And I got to hear from USC students, from UCLA students, from UOP students. And it was really great to hear all their feedback together, okay? So that, these are just some of the things that you get when you join ASDA, all right? It is kind of like a seal of approval on your application that you care about something larger than yourself. To hold something, be a part of something bigger, that's real. That's not just like a slogan that, you know, some cheesy thing that they put on their, on, on, you know, their website and stuff like that. It's actually a real living thing. So it, it is very cool, and I do implore all of you to join ASDA. So, yeah. Make yourselves outstanding. You know, be better than that one dental student, that pre-dental student who wasn't in ASDA. You know, so do it. Why not? I mean, sixty-three dollars gets you all that. Uh, you should join, and we win. Again, on their website. It's yeah. on their website, and you know, to, you can put on your application. I was part of a class that won ASDA's first annual competition. And you right? get the glory of. Yeah, UCLA is huge on ASDA. So even if you're thinking about applying there, I suggest that you guys join ASDA because they are, no offense, they're so much bigger on ASDA than USC is. Like they're ASDA at everything. When we visited their school, they had a, like an hour long section where they just talked about ASDA. Right, Michelle? I don't know, I never did. Okay, great. <laughs> 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 okay, no, but to be completely honest, like I have friends that I you one have of my friends? I have friends from New York that go to state schools and that go to Stony Brook and are in the pre dental honor society there and that are posting about like as a week and like as a what, whatever the hashtag was last yeah, year. Yeah. And like we beat them. So like this is a national thing and the fact that our club won last year makes us really stand out. Yeah. And if we won again this year, like it, it makes us really, really stand out nationally in terms of all, at all schools. It will make us really look good. And we also got like $1,000 worth of Chipotle last year. Yep. Just $1, saying, $1, awesome meeting. I don't think anyone really. If we win the competition, if we win the competition again, we get a personalized meeting. Yeah. Right? It's like an e meeting where they kind of, of us Skype, Skype us. us. And they talk about, you know, it's, it's like the heads of ASDA, right, who are clearly influential, and dental student heads of ASDA, right, their dental student counterparts, who talk to us about how to get into dental school, what we can do in ASDA as pre-dental students, how we can further make ourselves stand out. Last year, a huge topic that you guys had questions about was, um, how do I refine my manual dexterity for dental school? They talked about that. So it's very, very cool. It's very cool. Yeah. And it puts us on a national level, again. You know, to say that you're part of the USC Pre-Dental Honor Society, a nationally known organization over another dental society. That's a good thing. It is a great thing. Did anybody have questions? I saw some hands up. What's up? 
Yeah, you can you can go. I suggest doing it through us, just so that you're not liable for like, oh, my credit card, you know, they charged me, they didn't charge me, you know, stuff like that. That way, it's on us. If anything, we will. I'm gonna give you guys the application today. You guys can fill it out, put in your credit card, check whatever you want to attach to it. But we will be accepting until Sunday because we're gonna mail them all out on Monday. So, so yeah, you have until Sunday to get something. How many licenses have you in the end? Uh. <laughs> we're part of this entity called District 11, and there's 11 districts across the United States. Uh, all six California dental schools are part of District 11, and every year we organize a statewide uh, conference. So it's just for all the students in California. So last year, it was really awesome because we got to, the meeting was held in San Francisco at the Brandy University Pacific uh, Dental School, and so we, we had our conference there last going to come around. Uh, keep an eye out for it. I'm guessing probably around the same time in October. Um, you know, if someone, if I can have a live liaison, I'll, I'll email you guys the information about conference until the time comes. I believe this year is going to be at Western, but I'm not sure yet. Um, Which is close. But yeah, there is there is a there is a conference, a district conference every year. Question? Anyone else? Yeah. 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 So basically, <laughs> basically, whichever organization signs up as much pre-dental students to ASDA wins the competition, right? It's not exactly a competition of merit, but still. Because <laughs> we go to USC. You know, even if we lose, winning only further validates us as a really good pre-dental organization. So losing means nothing, but winning, why not? It helps, right? None of the money, no, not MS. None of the money going to us, by the way. It's all going to ASDA. So we keep none of it. We don't want it. Maybe Chris will just put it up. So I'm going to give you guys the application right now. You guys can turn it in right now if you want to. Cool. Don't have pens. I'm going to bring pens. No, no pens. Why is $64? random number. I'm going to stop this video right now. Oh, just go well.